Networks. This is First Morning Weather. Welcome back on your Monday afternoon. Started off this morning fit on the slushy side. A few of you saw some slick conditions out there and we got blanketed with a little bit of snow out there. As you can see from our airport sky cam, definitely feeling a little bit more like the holiday season out there. A little gloomy and definitely on the chilly side this afternoon. We'll continue to see cloud cover going throughout your Monday and even a few passing by flurries as northwesterly winds are beginning to take over and it will cause a few lake enhanced snow showers to pass by the region. Most of this will begin to taper off into your evening, but most of us will be looking on the dry and cold side going into the afternoon hours. Temperatures right now sitting at 35 in Tioga, Pennsylvania. Down in Germania, you guys are only up to 29. We're at 31 in Erin and 34 out in Canistillo this afternoon. Temperatures really just going to be struggling throughout the 30s this afternoon. Looking at mainly those mid to a few of us, those upper 30s and those wind gusts out of the north and west at 10 to 15 miles per hour could have some gusts upwards of 30 miles per hour actually make it feel a lot colder than it actually is out there. So make sure if you are heading out this afternoon or even into the evening, grab that jacket and make, maybe just make sure you have those mittens just in case you do get a little cold. Now the system that we dealt with this morning has pushed off to the north and east. We're going to see a nice northwesterly breeze that's going to keep these cool conditions into the rest of today. Let's fast forward it to tomorrow now. Well, we're going to see a little bit of change in that wind direction that's going to be out of the southwest, resulting in some nice warm up going into Tuesday. We're going to keep our eyes on a system that will pass by just to our north. It will extend a pretty weak cold front down as well as it approaches Tuesday evening and into the overnight Wednesday. We could see a few lake enhanced snow showers. Otherwise, behind it, we're tracking a little bit of a cool down into your Wednesday. We'll dip right back down into those 30s. We're going to see a warm up though going into the late week as high pressure builds just off to our west, continues to shift towards us into your Thursday and by about Friday, we'll be seeing temperatures nearly 10 degrees above average. Let's start off with today though. We're seeing at 37 on your Monday. We're slightly below average. Our high is usually right around 40 degrees this time of year. We'll just get right above average into Tuesday. We're seeing in those mid 40s, but I mentioned that cold front that will swing through Again, Tuesday night and into your Wednesday morning. That's going to result in, again, another wind shift. Some cooler temperatures on Wednesday. We'll be back in those mid-30s, and we'll continue in the 30s on your Thursday. Now we're going to see some high pressure build, some calm conditions, dry weather, and temperatures warming up to 50 degrees by the end of the week. And as we look ahead to this upcoming weekend, we'll be seeing those mid to even upper 40s, and those dry conditions are likely to continue. For today, though, 37 will be your high. Mostly cloudy skies are expected going into the rest of your day. Some cold and windy conditions with those gusts upwards of 30 miles per hour. Again, 44 fair skies Tuesday, Wednesday. We're going to chill it back just a bit, but we'll end up this week with plenty of sunshine and temperatures rising up to that 50 degree mark. This weekend, we'll see variable cloud cover continue on a dry trend and temperatures will be in the mid to upper 40s. Renata.